everyone. Peter Hewitt, La Artistino here. This week is um, day seven and it is a plant. So I've got to draw a plant girl. Now I've done a few sketches here in my sketchbook. I wanted to try to be a little bit more original. I have these ones here. What I did basically was I started researching different plants on um, the internet and coming up with sort of ideas and letting my mind go wild. Um, in the end I've come up with this one here which I kind of like and that is the one that we will be painting today. So I've taken my little Holcroft Travelers sketchbook which is marketed in the US as Pentallic um, Travelers um, pocket sketchbook and I have sketched my little plant girl there. I don't like it as much as the original picture. I think I've lost a little bit there but it doesn't matter. It often happens when you sketch something you really like it and then you try to re-sketch it to draw it and it just doesn't come out the same. Anyway, we'll push on with this one and see how we go. I've got my ink tense blocks here, which I'm going to use to make a background, and I have my ink tense pencils here, which I will do most of the detail work with. And I will also finish off with uh, some polychromos just to refine some of it and do a little bit of dabbing and sparkle with my white Signo Uniball gel pen. Anyway, let's begin.
So I started off this monster challenge with this sketch here and this is the finished product. It's not a hundred percent happy with the results. I think I was um, the colors that I picked didn't quite work as well as I wanted them to. I do love this color combination here of these types of oranges and these sort of like very warm uh, mauve colors and the yellow so I'll probably see them again sometime in my artwork. Well that's it for this week's Monster Girl Challenge. I hope you enjoyed watching me um, struggle with this particular Monster Girl but there she's done, the Plant Girl. Join me next week for another Monster Girl Challenge. We'll be working on number eight. I will see you then and until next time uh, have fun with whatever colouring adventures you are currently on and happy colouring. Hope you're enjoying any colouring adventures that you are currently on and until next time, happy colouring! <laughs>